Okay, so I am just leaving my house right now. So I'm like adjusting my seat whenever Jay drives my car. He always <laughs> moves the seat back like naturally because he's so tall. Woo. It's really bright out here. Okay, so now it's like really bright and I know I feel like I look like so scary because I don't have on any mascara. I need to put my sunglasses on because it's so bright. Um, so I don't have on any mascara or eyeshadow or eye brow. Like I didn't fill in my brows. Um, I do have on makeup on the rest of my face like but no under eye concealer or anything um, because I am going to get my eyelash is done. I'm getting eyelash extensions today and I'm really really nervous so it's 10 10 now and my appointment is like a little over an hour away and it's at noon I have to drive on the interstate so I just want to make sure I would make it on time and I've never had this done before so I'm so nervous like I'm so scared because I don't feel like my eyelashes are terrible so I don't want to mess them up but um this place that I'm going to, they're like rated the absolute best in the area. There's really no one else that does them. So the place that I'm going to specializes in eyelash extensions and they do microblading for brows and like eyebrow extensions and just permanent makeup and stuff like that. So they only do lashes and brows. Um, they do like eyebrow threading and waxing and stuff. So I've heard so many good things about this place and I've seen a lot of before and after pictures. I'll leave a link to their website down below in the description box of this video. Um, so yeah, I'm really excited. I'm probably not gonna bring the camera in just because we all know that I'm terrified of filming in public. And this is my first time going there. However, if I have like a really good experience, I'm gonna have to get them touched up. I'm getting them now for our wedding. Um, so I'm gonna have to get them touched up before um, or like relash or whatever, I don't know. Um, so if I like feel comfortable and I can get someone to come with me like my mom or Jay to film then I will this hair always makes me crazy um if I can get them to come with me then I will definitely um ask the ladies if I can film the process because I'm always so scared and like I've seen a few videos of people getting it done but I feel like if you get like a full review and like you can see the process or whatever then you feel a little bit better about it so if um, everything goes well I will hopefully bring you guys along next time so I'm gonna go because I'm driving and I'm about to pull out onto the highway other than driving down my long driveway so I will check in with y'all later Okay, so I made it over here and I haven't went in yet. I did just go to Starbucks and get a green tea. Mm. And I got these, um, let's see, these like salted kettle corn chips and they're really good. Just as a snack before I go in because my appointment is at noon. It's 11.51, so I got here a little bit early. I just saw the lady go in. Um, so I'm gonna give her a few minutes, I think, and then I'm gonna go ahead and go in for my appointment. I'm so nervous, I'm so scared. I'm gonna leave my camera in the car though. I'm not gonna bring it in because I don't wanna be like creepy on my first appointment. Gosh, I feel like I look so bad without any eye makeup on and anything. So I hope my lashes don't get destroyed. I'll be sure to let you guys know. I just want them to be really pretty for my wedding weekend and I don't wanna have to like reapply or anything like that. So I don't know if you can see if I can do like a before I don't know. It's hard to video your lashes with your eyes shut by yourself. So let's try. Let's see. Let me, there we go. Let's see if you can see them before and then I'll show you after. So they're not amazing. I hope you're not getting up my nose shot. Oh, like I said, they're not amazing, but they're not terrible and I just don't want them to be ruined. So yeah. Oh, also before I go in, I share this last week oh, I'm gonna show you I shared this last week on my snapchat but I just got this lip gloss and I love it so much I'm wearing it today I love the bu buxom glosses but this is in the shade white Russian I'll leave it in a link below and I'm not sure if this is like just their regular gloss or if it's like their um, matte lip color it's not matte but if it's just like a lip color or whatever 
and I'm wearing this over top of my Tom Ford um, nude vanilla lipstick and I just love this oh it's so perfect it's beautiful so that's the combo that I'm wearing it's just a very like nude kind of pale lip without being too like brown too orange too pink I just oh I love it it's so flawless it's my favorite so I'm gonna go ahead and go in I wish me luck I'm so nervous okay so I'll see you guys when I get back okay so I forgot to film earlier because I'm terrible at this um and traffic was just really bad on my way home so now it's a little bit later I look scary because I have no makeup on but I did get my eyelashes done and I'm really, really happy with the result. Um, so I'll try to hold it a little bit closer. i uh, sorry, it's so hard to like film and try to like check the viewfinder to make sure that um, you can actually see. So this is what they look like. Um, I just got like a classic set. Um, yeah, I just told her I wanted some length. I didn't want too much volume because I didn't want them to look really really fake sorry i just have like a lot of acne we know the struggle with the acne um so yeah i think they just have a lot of length i need to get some little spooly things to brush them with i'll probably go get some of those tomorrow my hair looks really not so great neither does my face i just washed my face um really carefully because i'm not supposed to get my eyelashes wet so i just um did like some soap around and wiped it off with a washcloth. Um, Jay and I went to the gym and he's downstairs doing some work things. So I just wanted to update you, but I'm really, really happy with the result. I think they're really pretty. Um, so yeah, I'm so happy, but I'll keep you posted. I might vlog a little bit tomorrow cause I feel like this has been a really short vlog, but I wanted to bring you guys along. Um, like I said, hopefully next time I'll bring you actually into the place. So if you're interested in seeing that, let me know. Good morning, everyone. So it has officially been over a day since we last spoke, um, and I just decided to pick up my camera. It was sitting on my bedside table from the other day, yesterday. Um, I just got a lot of stuff done around the house, and so, um, well, I say a lot. I still haven't done any of my laundry. Anyways, um, so I just forgot to vlog, and I didn't do it. But today I was going to, so right now, oh. I'm just having some coffee. Just watching a YouTube video from Alexandria Garza on the Alex and Michael channel. I love watching their vlogs, so you should go check them out. I'll leave a link to their blog or their vlogs in a com in the description bar below. And I'm working on putting together today's blog post. I gotta start writing, and I'm gonna be talking about some of my favorite sweaters for fall. So I'm gonna get started on that. Um, I have a meeting in a couple of hours. Oh, it's so, it's so like orange in here. I don't know what's wrong with that. No makeup on. My face looks terrible. Um, so I have a meeting in a couple of hours with my like financial planner. Um, and I'm not really sure what we're going to talk about. So, and then I need to run some errands. I need to go get some little spoolie things and figure out how to clean these things. So I'm probably going to do that too. Um, gosh, I look terrible right now. Look at this little baby. How cute he is. Oh, you don't like your paws touched. No, you don't. Oh my goodness. Look at that face. Is that a little pouty face? <laughs> this is your little pouty face. Oh my goodness. You're so sleepy. It's time for your mid-morning nap, isn't it? <laughs> Weasel. You don't want to say hi? Okay, no say hi. He's going to sleep now. <gasps> what are you doing? <laughs> you don't like being on camera, do you? Look at that face. <laughs> Aww. He's so sweet. Of the 
day. So this top is from Ann Taylor Loft. These jeans are AG. My shoes are from J. Crew, and my bag is my Saint Laurent sac de jour. So, okay. okay, so I just finished my meeting, and now I am. I don't know where I'm going now. I'm lost. Oh, okay. I need to go that way. Anyway, so I just finished my meeting, and now I need to go get some. I need to go to Sally's Beauty Supply and get some things. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Get some little spoolie thingies for my eyelashes. And I really need to know what I can wash them with because I've read online that like you're not supposed to use all these different types of products on them, um, but you're supposed to keep them very clean. So I'm like, what am I supposed to wash them with? Like, I don't want to mess them up. So if you have any recommendations, leave them for me in a comment. Um, I'm probably gonna go get something to eat because it's 10.54 and I've been awake since like 7. Okay, so Jerry just called and um, I was gonna show you my food but I was so hungry because I haven't eaten anything today that I've already eaten like half of it. So now that I've like regained, regained my consciousness and got my hangry under control and I'm possibly like almost done actually, I'm gonna show you what I had. So I went to Cafe Rio, which is like completely my new jam. I got a cheese quesadilla. It probably doesn't look very good because it's kind of greasy, but it's so good. The chicken is like shredded chicken and they like have it in like the sauce and water. So um, that's why it's all wet. And then I just got some lettuce and some sour cream. I asked for like, I told him I would pay for extra sour cream and extra guacamole. And the guy just gave me two scoops of sour cream and no guacamole. So I don't know. I, I just felt too bad to say anything. And then I got a root beer because I'm a terrible person. So that's what I'm having for brunch today. It's probably, oh, I'll probably eat later. But I seriously love these quesadillas. Like they're so delicious. And they're probably like 5,000 calories, but they're worth every, every last drop. So I'm gonna finish eating this and then I'm gonna go to Sally's. I'll see you guys later. So I just got home from running errands and I'm here with this cute little guy. I have so much laundry on the floor. Oh my goodness. Oh, you just put your face in the camera. Hello. So I just want to show you really quickly what I got at Sally's. I was able to find some of these. I don't know that I need to change them every single time I use them. So. I just got, they're like, I got the curved in and just the regular um, mascara wands. So hopefully these will, one of them will be, I almost thought these would be easier, but like to use because um, my lashes are like curled, um, but I wasn't really sure. So I just got one of each. They're only a couple of dollars a piece. So I figured I'd get those. And then I picked this up. This is the gel mascara remover and it says it's oil free. So, um, I don't know, but okay, it's oil. I heard that I needed to use oil free, but then I almost feel like it said don't use gel. I have no idea. So I need to figure out if this is safe to use on my lashes. Those are what I got. I also, side note, I got picked up a Bible, a journaling Bible. So I had been using my mom's Bible for a while. So I picked up this one. This is the ESV version the English standard version it has really small writing, which I was like, Ooh, I don't know, but it gives you like some room on the side. I had like a hard time finding what I wanted because I wanted one that was flexible like this and bendy and not just like hard cover. Um, but I didn't want soft cover. I wanted like this. I don't know if it's leather or yeah, it says bonded leather. Um, so I don't know. I'm happy. I like it. So we'll see, hopefully I'll be able to do some highlighting and writing and studying in this. I am just going to do some blog writing. I just put a post up, it went up a little bit late today. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna do some blog writing. I need to film another video for my YouTube channel and hopefully maybe edit this vlog in a little bit. Um, just get to do some writing. I don't know why, I haven't felt very inspired to write for my blog in like a while. I have been, my posting schedule has been like terrible. But I'm feeling this like rainy fall weather makes me feel like a lot more inspired to write. So I'm hoping that 
I will want to write and read my book a little bit. So I will do that. Jay is working at our house. I just stopped by and saw him on my way home. He'll probably be coming over in a little bit. So yeah, I will check in later.